Hi friends! So in today's video, I'm going to install and put together this desk that I got on Amazon and I will include all the links in the description below this video for you to check out. Inside your box, you get a nice snap closure pouch with some post-it notes as well as a really nice ink pen to go along with your new desk. Inside you also have a plastic bag with a bunch of individual Ziploc bags all labeled with letters to indicate what part is what. Okay, so when putting this desk together, looking at the instructions, you want to decide if you're going to have this desk with the shelf on the left side or if you want your shelving on the right side. You can't just put it together and then flip it around. Um, the reason for that is because on one of the ends of the desk, there is going to be a little um, basket here, a little canvas type basket where you can put your notebooks and things. And you don't wanna flip it around and push this part up against the wall. You want this up against a wall. So let me show you guys real quick where I plan to put this desk. So my son's going to have his set up right here. Um, so we're going to have the shelf part of the desk on that wall and then the actual desk come out this way. So we are going to actually be needing to do the L steps. So on here I'm going to be following L step 1 all the way through. We have got a total of 10. So when you have it put together, the shelves will be on the left as this image shows here. If you need to do it where your shelves are on the right side, then you would want to follow the R step instructions and it would resemble this photo here. And then on this side, it shows you all your parts and your tools. So the first step to building this desk, whether it's left or right, you're going to take your three boards and put these gold little cam locks in each hole. You have a total of four cam locks and four holes. So you want to do this in all three boards for your first step. For this step, you're going to need 12 of your screws. It's labeled P, which is right here. And then you are going to need your shelves as well as your bars on each side which are right here and you have two of those second step you're installing your screws here by using the tool that came with your kit this one here um, I do want to point out do not over tighten because you will start to crack the metal and the paint so don't over tighten on that part tip I want to point out Make sure your cam locks are straight up and down so that the hole in them is facing towards the direction of the screw going into the metal. This will help ensure that it goes in safely. Quick tip friends, get you a hammer. You're gonna wanna use it to bang these screws into the metal until they take. Okay guys, fast forwarding quite a few steps. My son decided to jump ahead because it was taking me a night and day to get them screws into the metal with the tool that came with this set before realizing a hammer was what we needed. But once we used a hammer, everything pieced together rather quickly. Here on the side, we have our canvas organizer, which holds quite a bit of weight. Um, we actually tried it with some of his books and his binders, but for now we just have a few lightweight items in there because he likes to keep his other things right at hand and eye level. Um, so right here, he just keeps his notebooks and his binders and things right there. Um, this chair we just recently bought at a store called At Home and it fits perfectly underneath it. It's the perfect size. These bars were the last thing that we put on because, like I said, we were having issues with that one tool trying to get those screws in, but they went on and now everything is securely held together. Um, so you definitely want to make sure when putting those screws into this metal that you have a hammer. That is one of the biggest tips I'm going to give you when putting all this together. Uh, but everything holds really nicely. It's sturdy and I couldn't be any more happier with it for this school year. These desks are available in different colors, but I chose the white one. If you can see here, you can still see some of the wood grain even in the white, which goes really perfect with anything. Um, but the material is a nice gloss finish and it's easily wiped down with a damp rag or you can use some dust cleaner. Also, my friends, if you have them pesky, uneven floors, you have some screws here that go into the bottom of each leg, and this will help keep your surface area straight across so that when you're working, you don't have to worry about anything rolling off. You just turn them to the right or the left once you get them in, and that will help adjust your desk where it's even on all sides. 